Hydrocarbon Dynamics has developed a U.S. patented process, patent number 7334641, that enhances the oil well utilizing a triphase approach prior to the actual HCD triphase EOR application down hole we must grow up the bacteria to 10 to the 8th to 10 to the 9th colony forming units per milliliter. This is done by adding 5 pounds of the microphase bacteria product to typically a 300 gallon tank along with 5 gallons of the HCD bionutrient and allowing it to recirculate for about 24 hours. The key to this recirculation is that the water is a non-chlorinated water if there is some chlorine in the water it will kill the bacteria quite obviously however this is not a stopper if we add a small amount one cup to two cups of sodium metabisulfite which will neutralize the active chlorine and allow this water to be utilized for the grow up process also we need to maintain two to three part per million oxygen to ensure that we have the proper oxygen levels to grow up the bacteria to the 10 to the 8th, 10 to the 9th colony forming units per milliliter that will be quite necessary for the downhole application. This microphase product will be utilized for the longevity of the well's return so that we can see well returns with the increased production rate for six months to a year, ideally. In the actual HCD triphase application process, a applicator truck will drive up with the three products on that truck. The first product that will be utilized will be the HCD Multiflow product. This product acts much like a lance, liquefying paraffinetic and asphaltenic deposits, opening up fissures that were previously plugged or clogged by these deposits and allowing access to oil that was not previously accessible. The second product would be the HCD salt reducer. The salt reducer product is a chelator of calcium, magnesium, and sodium chloride deposits. This chelation process ensures that any of the deposition that occurred due to scale formation is also removed and is a key element in this triphase application. The third product that will be injected down the well will be the HCD microbial chain cutters or the HCD microphase that we just grew up 24 hours prior. Again we have a 10 to the 8th to 10 to the 9th colony forming unit per milliliter colony count on this product. We will inject it down hole following the salt reducer and its function is to anchor itself to the side walls of the fissures and as the heavy oil components go by it will eat those heavy oil components and then it will excrete a smaller oil component along with CO2 and water. This entire process is environmentally safe. Finally, we'll put a brine cap on top of the triphase process, typically 30 to 40 cubic feet of brine water, KCL being a good brine water. The entire cocktail will be squeezed into the formation based on the engineering recommendation to the depth that it will be squeezed. And then the well will be shut in for three days, allowing the bacteria to reduce further the paraffin and liquefy more effectively the asphaltenic deposits. After the three day shut in period, we realign the well back to production lineup, turn the pump back on, and we will notice an increase initially in gas production rate if the well is a gas well and we will start to see a steady increase in the oil production rate. Typical increases in production rate seen over the 11 year period of utilizing this process have been anywhere between 20 percent increase and 300 percent increase. So in conclusion the HCD triphase enhanced oil recovery process utilizes three environmentally safe products. First, the multi-flow, second, the salt reducer, and third, the microphase, all working synergistically and symbiotically to ensure the maximum efficiency of your downhole oil treatment 
regime. To get more information on this process, notify your local hydrocarbon dynamics representative or go to www.hydrocarbondynamics.com. Thank you.